July is a favorite summer holiday. Does your family do something special for the 4th of July? Do you go to a 4th of July parade, a carnival, a picnic, or barbecue? Do you watch fireworks at the beach, a park, or maybe after a baseball game? Do you wear red, white, and blue? Have you ever wondered why we do all these things on the 4th of July? Many Americans do these things to celebrate the 4th of July. The 4th of July is a holiday and we celebrate holidays to remember people and events of long ago. So what event does the 4th of July help us to remember? Independence Day. Independence Day, or what most Americans call the 4th of July, was a very important day in our country's history. On July 4th, 1776, over 200 years ago, the United States of America became a new country. So Independence Day is America's birthday. Before America became its own country, the people who lived here, who were called colonists, were ruled by a powerful country called Great Britain or England. England was ruled by King George III. For a long time, most colonists liked the king and obeyed his rules. But part of the reason why people came to America was to start their own way of life away from the king. The king became greedy and wanted to have more control over the people in America, which many colonists did not like. This started a revolution. A revolution is a big word for a fight over power. The colonists wanted to be in charge of themselves and they fought in a war for their freedom against England. During the war, five men were chosen to write a document, or a very important paper called the Declaration of Independence. The Declaration of Independence was written to explain why the colonists were fighting to have their own country separate from England. We hold these truths to be self-evident, that all men are created equal, that they are endowed by their creator with certain unalienable rights, that among these are life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. On July 4, 1776, the Declaration of Independence was approved or agreed to. The first July 4th celebration happened a few days later on July 8, 1776. The Declaration of Independence was read out loud to the public in Philadelphia. The crowd was so excited they reacted with bonfires and fireworks. Why do you think that they celebrated this way? Well, in England, people celebrated the king's birthday the same way, with bonfires and fireworks. So the American colonists did the same thing to celebrate freedom from the king. Even though America was free, the colonists fought in the war against England for many more years to protect their freedom. Eventually, America won the war, and every year since, Americans have celebrated independence from England. Even now, over 200 years later, we still celebrate Independence Day on the 4th of July. How cool is it that Americans do the same things, like go to parades and watch fireworks, just like they did a very long time ago when our country became free from England. People all around our country gather together to remember and celebrate Independence Day, the day the United States of America became a free country.